quick today's motivational minute is be willing to compromise. So be willing to compromise. Now I'm not saying compromise your morals or compromise who you are or compromise your integrity. But sometimes when you're in a situation where you're collaborating with people, you've got to be willing to compromise. It can't always be your way or the highway. If it's your way or the highway, then uh, it becomes challenging to get things done. Because oftentimes in my periscopes, I talk about how it's important to have people in your corner. It's important to collaborate. It's important to, to ask questions. What's up, Johnny? Thanks for joining. It's important to just get to know what's going on. But if you have the mindset that you are always right, that you always know what's going on, that you always have the right perspective, here, I'm going to give you guys a, I'm going to put the mic a little closer to my mouth. Seems a little noisy out here. Um, all right, a little better. So if you if you feel like you're always right and you're not willing to compromise, if you're not willing to give somebody else a chance to contribute, what's up, Sobier999? If you're not willing to have that dialogue and at least try other people's perspectives, it's challenging to be successful. The most successful people, thank you, Lazaretto. Uh, uh, most people are not willing, or some people that want to be successful don't realize the importance what's up Raphael thanks for tuning in don't realize the importance of collaboration and that sometimes you do have to take a back seat when other people have ideas or contributions for what's going on thanks for inviting followers Raphael I appreciate it Raphael y'all follow Raphael he's an amazing kid he's in the 11th grade he's doing big things check out his Facebook and his and his uh, his Twitter I'm so proud of this guy he's in the Bahamas 11th grade I got a Sydney is a senior in high school. I got the I got the young cats listening in, so this is amazing. I've got a CEO on, a need for grace, a CEO. I've got mid-level employees. It's awesome, 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 awesome. But as you're going through life, if you want to be successful, it takes working with people. And you are not always going to be right. Now, you may be right a lot of the times, but you've got to be willing to listen to other people's ideas, listen to other people's perspectives, try other people's ideas and other people's perspectives because at the end of the day, the goal is either to get the job done, to finish the project, to get the grade that you're looking for, to find people that you can add to your inner circle. You can't do that if you're the only one contributing to your inner circle. And if people don't feel as though you can, uh, if people don't feel like they can contribute to what you're doing or what you're saying or what you're participating in, they're not gonna wanna help you. They're not going to want to join your inner circle, and they're not going to want to really hang on with you. What's up, Chanel Ghost? Thanks for joining. They're not going to want to take the time to know that every single time they pitch something to you, you shoot it down. Now, in life, you never know what idea is going to take you to success. You never know what idea, what component, what, uh, what step, what thing is going to take you to where success is for you. So I challenge you today to step it out and be willing to compromise and listen. When it comes to compromising and listen, it means you're just listening to the ideas of the people that you trust and you're giving this information out and asking for advice or asking for information or someone just volunteers a better way to do something. Hear them out. Hear them out. No, it can't always be your way or the highway. And I challenge you to step it out to really make sure that as you're working on yourself, you're working on who you are, how you do things, how you grow, how you look at life, and when you do so, know that it's not all going to work because of you. It's not all going to work because of because how you do things. Um, when they talk, you respect them more, for sure. People who listen more than they than when they talk, for sure. That is amazing. When people are listening, when you're listening, you get that respect from people. So be willing to compromise, be willing to listen, and be willing to try other people's ideas. That's today's Motivational Minute. It was a short, sweet, until the point when, as I said, I'm here at the Pirates Adventure with um, the wife for a birthday party. We're about to go have some fun, but I had to address you all. Thank you for the hearts. Thank you for the love. Follow me here on Periscope. Check out my website, danielpferguson.com. I want to hear from you. I want to coach you guys. I'm a career coach, motivational speaker, um, uh, interview prep with my team, the whole shebang. Go to my website, danielpferguson.com. You can check out Former, you're welcome. You're very, very welcome, Kitchy. Uh, if you guys follow me, I'll follow you back. Those that don't know, really quickly, I'm a mid-level manager here in Hollywood. I've got about 150 direct reports that come straight to me. 
50 indirects, so about 200 people that I oversee on a daily basis. Have a nice party. Thank you. So thank you all for joining. Tune in uh, for tomorrow. Thanks for the words. Always appreciate it. Hey, Raphael, I appreciate you, bro. Truly appreciate you and everybody on. But remember, as always, words bring life. Speak them into existence. Your greatness is waiting. I'll see you all tomorrow. Check me out. Follow me on Twitter so that way you can know when I'm going live. Thank you, guys. I appreciate y'all. Thank you for the hearts. And I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Have a good night.